And on with the show. Here we go with our next bout. Fighting out of the blue corner. Coming to the cage, please welcome Guy Rednauer. I like Guy a lot. I'm excited to see what he's got here. If I'm not mistaken, I think he was our last minute fill as well. Yeah, he was. He definitely was. So he's stepping up and uh, getting in there. Yeah, he, uh, he's he been working with a lot of the guys uh, fighting tonight, getting them ready. So I'm, I'm stoked to see what he's got here. That's awesome. He does have a few MMA bouts under his, under his belt. So. Okay, awesome. Uh, Cole and I uh, saw a guy yesterday when Cole's checking in. Uh, Cole's an interesting fact, so he gives the best hugs, and Guy saw that, so he wanted a hug. Yeah, man, Guy is super cool. Uh, I think he, his name is Smiley Guy. That's what he goes by, Smiley Guy. <laughs> I like that. I think, uh, was it Sam Smiley? Uh, the UFC, he might question yeah. something on that. Right. Colton Wayne Gourley. We've seen Gourley a few times as well in here. Colton Gorley always has some good showings here. He's always he's always good and clean. He's a, he's a good fighter in my opinion. This will be a good fight for both of these guys. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner to my left. He stands five foot nine inches tall. He is dressed in black, trimmed in gold, and he represents fierce martial arts. From Cambridge City, Indiana, now fighting out of Newcastle, Indiana. Please give a big round of applause for Guy Smiley Rittenauer. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. He stands six foot three inches tall. Ladies and gentlemen, he is dressed entirely in black, and he is from Muncie by way of Selma, Indiana. Please welcome Colton Wayne Gorley. Three to the ground, scheduled. 185 is going to go at it here. Stefan Huber, come to the blue corner immediately. Gorley looks ready. Got a focused look, touch the gloves, here we go. Ooh, guy opening with a leg kick. Colton caught some hands on him when he did it though. Ooh, another good leg kick by Guy. Good solid leg kicks to open up. Ooh, working some movement, big overhand right. Good check. Ooh. Colton going for teeth. Good jab by Colton went through. Clawed with the cross, kind of missed on that one though. Good little two punch combo there. Yeah, body head, that's good. Oh. I think that was an attempted high kick by Colton. Guy kicked his legs out with a low kick.
filling out process by both the guys here. Yep. Good naked straight right there by Colton. Colton's got some good, good straight right hands. Solid. There you go, finding their distance. Good high kick by Colton. Get him another half step in. He had that. Jab. Guy comes back from the overhand right. Kind of grazes off there. Another low kick though by Guy. I like guys using the leg kicks. That'll take a lot out of your opponent. Yep. Now Guy's using some clench and knees to the body. Got him against the cage here right in front of us. There you go. Broken up. That's the end round of round one. number one. Good round. Good round. Both guys, I think, were uh, filling out each other and seeing where they could go. Both had some good points. Yeah, very back and forth. Guy with some good leg Two kicks. Brought to you by Colts First coming through some good straight rights. Rental. Tonight's bout brought to you in part by Fierce Party Rental. 765-388. A couple of those leg kicks on that four, replay four, there. One, nine, all of your party rental needs including tables and chairs. Come on, Newcastle, let me hear you. Cheer loud and proud for your favorite fighter right now. Come on, let me hear ya. Get ready to start round Here's number two. Here's round two. Straight back to it. Let's see if they can pick up where they left off. Good little snap jab out there by Guy. Yes, sir. A little side kick. Looking good. Ooh. Yeah. Come with a heavy right. Good solid leg kicks. I'd like to see I'd like to see a couple one of these guys throw a little bit of an angle in right before they attack. Both got a lot of good lateral in and out. Guy trying to change the angle a little bit there. Ooh, he set up, one with a high kick, one over the head. He went for it. He, yeah, he went way up for it. Regardless whether it connects or not, you're always going to get your opponent to think about it once you go upstairs. Nobody wants kicked in the head. Absolutely. You no, know, when I was younger, that's what I told people. You want some of this, I'm going to kick you in the head. Yeah, and I promise you they didn't want none of that. <laughs> Colton trying under. to use some feints there. It was good. Using them feints, you got to jump on them right when the guy bites. Ooh. That's good. Colton went to throw that straight right. It did get through, but his leg got kicked out at the same time. Guy has some powerful leg kicks. He keeps sweeping that leg out. He's getting it. That's the there end it is, round two. two. I'll say him being a last minute fill. There was a little bit of a weight difference. Advantage for Guy. That's where you got to use it sometimes, though. True, true. Folks, round three brought to you by Handy Guy Man looks calm out there. He's smiling with his, when his team's coming in. Probably still laughing about that high kick that dropped him on his back. Yeah. Colton looks really tight. Colton looks really nice. His stance is always good. His, his, his straight right hands are always snappy and powerful. I'm always impressed when I see Colton. Colton adds a little bit more angle to his game, and he'll land a lot more of those shots. It's a little step to the right, a little step to the left right before he does it, man. He'll, he'll start landing a lot more. 
and they'll work that out. A lot of these guys are brand new. Well, like you know. he said, he's, he's got the, the basics of what he needs right there. He's staying solid in his, in his stance. And guy right now, here is your third and final round. That was good. Ooh. Both stepping off that straight right. Couple exchanges of some kicks. Good teeth by Cole. I'd like to see a little more pressure from either one. Once they get, once they get uh, get off on something, they need to apply the pressure a little Absolutely. bit. Absolutely. I think that would be the decider in this. Well, that's something I myself have even been working more of. That was a good little straight right hand. And Colton's got to keep pushing the action. There it is, T-Kick, you need to stay on that. Once that T-Kick connects and he goes against that cage, you need to stay on it. Pressure the whole time. Guy stays inventive, he'll, he'll, he'll land some things. That's what he's been doing this whole fight, being very inventive. That's good. There you go, Cole. There we go. Hook. Now, we're, now we're fighting. There's that extra pressure you're talking about. They got to throw. There it is. Yeah, we're, we're going to get that break. Got the go. Cole's got to keep that pressure. Exactly. There it is. It's against the cage. Keep that pressure. Oh. Keep that pressure. Ooh, good, good, good kick. Good the body there, Colton. Guys got to dig down deep now. Come in the final seconds. Somebody needs to pour it on here. This is going to be the decider. That's the end of the round, good, the end of the bell. Ladies and ending. gentlemen, let's hear it for Colton Wayne Gourley and Guy Rednauer. We go to the scorecards. Good third fight, man. It's, it'd be tough to call this one, too. I think Guy could take this just from the leg kicks, but Gorley could absolutely take it just because he applied the pressure at the very end. He wanted to finish it. Yeah, he seemed like the, towards the end of the second third round he was really starting to take control of what he wanted to do and that's really like you said in the judge's eyes right there everybody watches a different fight what I see could be totally different from what you see or any of the three judges so hey <laughs> that's the truth Folks, a round of applause once again for both of these warriors. All right, here we go with the judge's decision. At the end of three hard fought rounds, we go to the fierce party rentals scorecards, where once again, the judges have come to a split decision. Our first judge scores about 29 to 28. He has it for Colton Gourley. Second judge scores about 29 to 28. He has it for Guy Rednauer. Third judge scores the bout 29 to 28 for your winner by split decision victory out of the red corner from Muncie, Indiana, Colton Wayne Gurley. All right, guy wasn't too happy about that decision there. A split decision is a hard one. It definitely hurts. Any decision hurts. Absolutely. A split decision. 
is a little tougher to take. Yeah, it just kind of grabs you in the beginning of it. <laughs> yeah, hats off to both of the guys, though. They, they put it out there. Good uh, showing. That was a very good fight. I said for Guy coming in last minute, a great showing for him. And uh, Cody Colton, excuse me, showed exactly why he practices the way he does. I mean, he stayed stern to his style and, and worked it through and came out victorious.